Hello, my name is Konstantin, this is Project How To Do, and today I'm going to show you how to build a Tesla coil. Probably you may know this device from computer games, movies or some music Tesla show, whatever they call it. If we ignore the mystic around the Tesla coils, it's just a heavy touch resonance transformer working without a core. So, as not get bored from theory, let's jump to the practice. There is a circuit of coil. As you can see, it's very simple and we need only a few components. Power supply 9 to 21 volts. Also, it's gonna work from batteries with same voltage. Little heatsink, transistor 1309 or 1307, or almost any NPN transistor with similar parameters. Variable 50 kilo ohm resistor, 180 ohm resistor, Cooper winding wire 0.1 0.3 mm. I use 0.19 mm, which is 36 American wire gauge, about 200 meters. As always, list of all components with links into description. Also, we need a frame for a secondary coil. It could be any dielectric cylinder, diameter of approximately 5 cm and weight about 20 cm. In my case, it's piece of 1.5 inch PVC pipe. Let's begin from the most complicated part, secondary coil. It has 500 to 1500 turns, turn to turn, my is about 1000 turns. Take the beginning of wire and wind. Actually, you don't need to count every turn, simply multiply diameter of wire to number of turns you plan to make. It's going to be your winding weight. When you done fix the wire with some tape or better by couple layers of varnish. Primary coil is much easier. I put paper tape sticky side out in case to save ability to move it and wind about 10 turns of regular wire in PVC insulation. Next is soldering, all under the circuit. PCB is not necessary. Be careful when make variable resistor. 9 of 10 coils didn't work because it's soldered wrong. Connect primary and secondary coil. Later has a special insulation which must be scraped off before soldering. So we're done. Before you turn on the power at first time, place the variable resistor in the middle position and put light bulb near to the coil, because usually you'll not see high voltage spark immediately, and the only thing noted that it's working is light bulb. Turn on power and slowly turn the variable resistor. Congratulations! It's quite weak coil, and you cannot get electrical shock because of skin effects, but anyway be careful. And don't place any electronic devices such as cell phone, computers, etc. near to the working coil. And notice that high voltage sparks is made of plasma and it's actually very hot. If Tesla coil doesn't work, try to flip wires from primary coil, usually it helps. Also you can try to add or subtract a couple turns from it. Now let's talk about improving results. First you can do is rise voltage, but I don't recommend go over 25 volts at this circuit. Second is playing with primary coil. Logic is simple, fewer turns, more current, equal more power and more heating. I stopped at 5 turns. Also try to move it around secondary. But to be honest the circuit is bullshit and can run only like simple model for beginners. Next time I'll show you how to build real device. That's it guys, thanks for watching, see you next time and don't forget to check my other videos.